The Union Lady Bulldogs were not expected to beat the legendary Pat Summit and the number three ranked Lady Volunteers in Knoxville. However, the experience they got from the match was all the worthwhile. The Union's Lady Bulldogs were challenged facing the Division I NCAA club. The Union supporters and boosters made a five hour drive to the Although they expected it to be, fans said they enjoyed the atmosphere and wanted to support the team. Oh, this is great. We appreciate UT doing this, and, and we know that most young people don't get a chance to play in a situation like this. We're just, we're just excited and hope that it will help our kids grow and make, toward the end of the year, make for a better season. Even students came to watch the game, driving back the next night. Well, it's a great experience to come see them play against a, a team as good as UT. Uh, it, just to play in an atmosphere this big and on this big of a level is a really neat experience. And uh, I, I, I came last year and saw them play, and it was uh, just really cool. Wanted to come back again, and luckily was able to find the ride. Despite the loss, fans were encouraged by Union's performance. Union and Tennessee fans alike stood for Pat Summit she took the floor. In August, she was diagnosed with dementia. She will continue coaching this season and says she does not plan to retire soon. Players and coaches said the game exposed weaknesses that will help them prepare for the rest of the season. Reporting for the Cardinal Cream, this is James Summerlin.